Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in, Alessandro the Crypto here, I hope you're doing all fine. So before we start with today's Bitcoin technical analysis, I have some good news for all the members and users for Bybit and Femex. Let's start with the good news about Femex because on Femex from now on you can easily buy Bitcoin, Ethereum and Tether using your credit card. So this is the first leverage exchange where you can now buy also directly with fiat so with your credit card cryptos. So if you're already a member of Femex or if you need an account on Femex Go down below to the video description with my link if you sign up with this link that you find down below here in the video description you will get $72 sign up bonus and from now on you can also buy very easily Bitcoin with your credit card. So let me know in the comment section if for you this is good news that you can now buy Bitcoin with credit card or do you prefer to buy Bitcoin using bank transfers. So let me know in the comment section if you like to buy Bitcoin with credit card or it's better to just make bank payments for example to Coinbase to buy cryptos. So in my opinion this is a very good news and it makes it very very easy now to buy easily and instant with credit card cryptos. So if you want to try it out because the minimum is $100 if you want to buy crypto here on Femex let me know if you already tried it out and how it works because so far I didn't use it but I'm planning to use it once to see how fast you will get here. The Bitcoins is completely new on Femex so far so definitely go down and sign up to Femex because only signing up you only need the email if you want to purchase also with your credit card cryptos then of course you have to go through the identify process where also most likely you have to upload your ID and so on but anyway when you want to buy Bitcoin with fiat usually always you have to put also your ID and so on so I think here it will be easier and faster anyway but let me know in the comment section what you think about that and the second good news is about the Bybit because also here we have this rewards hub where you can get $90 free bonus if you use my sign up link that you also find down below here in the video description and this good news is for all newcomers and also for everyone that is already member in Bybit because currently on the rewards hub we have two new flash deals so two new $5 coupon and bonuses the one here strategy alert is very easy you just have to log in in your app and put an alert on Bybit and immediately you will get this five dollars additional so very easy and you don't have to do anything and the other one here with five dollars is if you purchase a mutual insurance this is only possible once you are in a trade you can do that almost for free so if you do this you will get an additional five dollars as well but this is only if you are already in a trade then you have the option to buy this insurance. So these two deals are completely new on Bybit so if you're already a member using my link or if you want to open up a new account you can use my sign up link that you find down below here in the video description and you will get this extra $10 completely for free and remember that we still have two days left for this extra $100 bonus if you want to use it first you have to be signed up with my link into Bybit and second you have to put at least a 0.2 Bitcoin deposit in order to get this $100 for free that Bybit manually will add into your account within the next three days. So it's valid only for the next two days if within these two days you will put this 0.2 Bitcoin. So don't forget in case that you want to claim this free bonus. So and now we can start with today's TA because as you can see here in the light it's red. Bitcoin currently lost here the support so far so we went below 9430 also the S&P took a hit so Bitcoin currently is perfectly following the S&P 500 and we still didn't decouple from it and based here on the TA on Bitcoin it looks like that 9450 could become here the new resistance and we could see here a big move to the downside. The problem is that in the past we have seen a lot of uh, fake to the upside but also to the downside so it's really hard to tell right now where we are at currently because usually when I see something like this and also we have the confirmation that the old support is becoming new resistance then usually we should see a big move to 
the opposite direction to the resistance that we're testing currently but at the moment we just have too many fake outs and currently i'm not trading just based on these breakouts so i'm still waiting here for a big move because i think the real big move still have to come until then we're just gonna jump around here between nine to ten thousand dollars so as long as we're gonna stay between this range we will not have a clear breakout so in the lower time frames currently i don't give it too much significance but i'm also keeping an eye here in the one hour and four hour time frame but i think the truth we will see in the daily and weekly time frame because those are also the most important and they are also still looking bullish even though in the daily we still have to break some significant resistance that are above of us but let's start first with the one hour here quickly because here the rsi is again at the 50 level stochastic overbought and we're trading right at the 20 moving average in the one hour if we are not able to go back in track here above 9450 i think we could be in here for another test here of the lower fib line here of around 8000 $900 and potentially on the second attempt here to test it possibly also break it to the downside if we go over to the Bollinger Band here it looks a bit better because currently we are bouncing from the middle line so in theory we should see a retest of 9470 pretty soon MACD is also shifted to the upside if we go over to the 4 hour here also we are struggling to get above the moving averages here especially this year the 20 moving average so far it is acting as a resistance once more and the RSI is also testing now the 50 again stochastic is in neutral condition so also here in the four hour in my opinion it is starting to look more bearish than bullish even though here in the Bollinger Band we are right in the middle area so we are in a very critical point also here MACD is flat currently so as I told you here in the lower time frames it's really difficult to predict where the price could be moving in the short time frames but let's continue with the daily time frame because here you can see that we are still fighting with the 20 daily moving average we didn't have a confirmation that we are now trading above the 20 daily so once more we are squeezing here between the 20 and 50 daily moving average and this is gonna be decisive once we're gonna break out to the upside here or to the downside and close a candle there because i think this will signal where we're moving next so keep an eye here if we're gonna close a daily candle below the 50 daily moving average which currently is at 9380 or we're gonna close above 9495 so above the 20 daily moving average i think this will signal the next big move of bitcoin and the rsi is perfectly lining up at the 50 level stochastic is coming into neutral territory but has been oversold so also here it looks like that we are waiting here for a big big move here to the upside or downside i still have the feeling that we could see a major dump here a major correction to the downside but as I told you, if the stock market is continuing to pump and also here on Bitcoin, we can recover immediately back up above 9,500 and start to create supports and daily closes above, then I think we could be in here for a retest of 10K pretty soon. But as long as we're trading like this, I think a big dump is inevitable. And also if you go over to the Bollinger Band in the daily, you can see that currently here we are trading in the lower part. And also here in theory, we could easily drop towards 9,170. MACD is also shifted to the downside so here based on the Bollinger Band and the MACD we are again shifted to the downside this doesn't mean that we have to go immediately back to 6k or something like that but at least we could see a retest of 9000 and possibly also go towards our targets so at least towards here the 200 daily moving average which currently is at 8200 dollar and if we go over to the weekly time frame here you can see that although we are still trading above the 50 and 20 weekly moving average so everything is still okay here also RSI is above the 50 stochastic is overbought that is still what is concerning me a bit but also here you can see that as long as we close the weekly candles above $8,500 we should be good to go to the upside but of course it is possible that we could see a big week here to the downside towards 8k or possible also $6,500 dollar and if we have a look on the bollinger band in the weekly here also it is still looking very bullish macd shifted to the upside bollinger band is trading in the top area so also here in theory if we're gonna bounce here between 9000 and 8300 dollar we could in theory reach a target of 11200 dollar so also here in the bigger time frames i'm still very bullish even though a correction towards 8k even down to 6500 is very possible and that's why you should be ready for all scenarios 
notes. So with that said guys, I'm gonna wrap it up for now. Remember that currently we still have the special $100 bonus on Bybit. If you want to claim it, if you already signed up with my link or you need an account, use my link. Get this free $100 bonus and also use this bonus on Femex of $72 and create a free account over here because from now on you can also easily buy with fiat using your credit card. Very useful especially if the price for example would drop a lot and you don't have time to make a bank transfer and wait till it's gonna be on the exchange and then you are able to buy. So here you can buy instant with your credit card. So make sure also to be ready for that scenario and also create a free account account here over on Femex claim this bonus and be ready to buy in with your credit card and feel free to join also our free disco trading chat the chat is completely for free and everyone is a welcome shout out to all to you people you're the best and also I'm doing the live streams over on Twitch so make sure to join the Twitch channel if you have Twitch when something crazy is going on with the price and I am in my office I always go live so make sure also to join the Twitch channel so let me know down below also in the comments guys what do you think will we break down now or are we still on the way towards 10k let me know down below here in the video description and also don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel because we do daily ta videos and also you can participate to the bitcoin giveaway that i do with every 500 subscribers so thank you very much for watching guys and we see us all in the next one bye